you know, the only reason I've been more on pulse with the election is because I've been just looking the mundane port- portents. And um, I've known, and this is something Theodore, Theodore White and I discussed back this time last year. We knew it was going to be a establishment candidate backed by the American oligarchical elite that would be George Bush or Hillary Clinton versus a populist candidate. So we eliminated very early on that George Bush would be the nominee. Um, And we also eliminated early on that Bernie would be the nominee. So we knew it was going to be Hillary versus a Uranus Pluto dark horse candidate that was going to turn everything upside down, inside out, destroy the body politic of the nation. All right. And that and that's why we came to the well, I certainly came to the conclusion first and then Theodore followed up shortly thereafter. And we came to the conclusion it's going to be Trump. And Trump is the beginning of the first phase or a category one social revolution. This is not just another election like 99% of the astrologers. And I'm going to keep saying that. I know that upsets a lot of people. But 99% of the astrologers kept framing it as another uh, as another like a Bush Gore election 2000, except, you know, on steroids. No, 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 no. This is not just another election. We're seeing social revolution. That's just the fact of what had to happen in order for Trump to be the nominee. The fact that Hillary Clinton technically lost that campaign and still a nominee has completely medically collapsed and been and wasn't disqualified after she was medically diagnosed with uh, pneumonia. It's just startling. So we are seeing the populace, the rise of the populace or the nationalists versus the establishment, and the oligarchy. This is a collision, a titanic collision of an, un, an unmovable object with an unstoppable force, right? And they're colliding here. And this is just the beginning of things to come, folks.